stuff packs are finally coming back to The Sims 4. I feel like that Titanic scene, you know that meme where she's like, it's been 84 years, except it's nearly been three, which is a long time to not have stuff packs. But I think what happened is kits came out, they started releasing kits and stuff packs kind of just got forgotten about, but apparently not because now we're getting a new stuff pack called The Sims Chef Hustle Kit. Nothing. Home Chef Hustle stuff pack. <laughs> that is what it is called. And today we are going to be getting the trailer for this pack. They only literally announced it two days ago in the live stream. So I'm excited to see what's to come. I am also wondering what is going to be in this pack. Like what is going to be in this pack that couldn't be in base game? It's definitely not one that I would have anticipated them doing, to be honest with you. I'm assuming there's going to be like new recipes, maybe new ways of doing like cooking sales or whatnot, maybe putting up stands. I really don't know because we've got food stands, we've got like yard selling tables in The Sims 4 where you can sell things. So I am interested to find out what is going to be coming. And I'm not going to judge the pack yet because I haven't played it, don't know what's in it. Also, in the Behind the Sims Summit, in the background, when the Sim Gurus were talking, we saw like a recipe book on one side, we saw like a dish wall stand kind of thing. You know, one of those shelves where they've got plates on it, bits hanging from it, chopping boards, things like that. And we also saw kitchen concepts as well. Different kitchen concepts that they've been working on for this stuff pack. Let's watch the trailer and let's see what's coming. If you're looking forward to this new stuff pack, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Ooh, I love how they're mixing up the countdowns now. Every time we have like a new trailer, it's a new scene. Ooh, wait a hot second. We saw that in the sneaky peek. All right, let's do this thing. Okay. Oh, look at her little pizza earrings. Oh, that's a new outfit that she's wearing. I love how it's kind of messy. Sims 4 Home Chef Hustle. Old kitchen out, new kitchen in. Ooh, okay, look at these new kitchen counters. Oh, there's so many swatches. Okay, we're gonna have to go back. Wait, pizza oven? And then a chef aid mixer in Judah? <gasps> Ooh, okay. Oh my God, this music in the background. Oh my God, look at her. I used to work at Domino's. I did that. <laughs> this is so cool. Okay, so she can do her stall anywhere and sell it and make money. Okay. Little like side hustle. We got the waffle maker. We saw that in the sneaky peek. Chop throwing the things. I would never do that. I would take my head off. Okay. Cupcakes in the oven. Waffles. All sorts of things selling here. Oh, look at those outfits. That is a whole serve. What are we cooking? A salad? I don't know. Better than just a normal mixy bowl, though. Okay, this looks cool. There's a whole process to cooking now rather than just watching them doing the same thing. Those um, knives in the back are so cool. Look at all of this. Okay. Okay. Break in new appliances. Serve up new looks. Launch a side hustle. Oh, oh, we didn't do that well. Get busy. Okay, available 28th of September. So two weeks from now. Okay, I'm looking forward to, to this. I'm not gonna lie. I was a little apprehensive at first because I thought, you know, with this whole stall and selling thing, we can do that anyway. Like, you know, on the yard selling table, I've been selling different things through that and making money through doing that. Literally recently in my horse ranch series, I was selling nectar through that. At first I'm kind of like, do we really need something like this? But after seeing the trailer, this is just brought a whole hecking load of more excitement into me. We've got a little article to read about it. So let's read this and then we'll go through the trailer and digest everything in the trailer. Upgrade your kitchen with the Sims 4 Home Chef Hustle Stuff Pack. Live your cooking dreams and become a masterful home chef. Okay. If you want to be a top tier home chef, you need the right tools and workspace. In the Sims 4 Home Chef Hustle Stuff Pack, players can renovate their Sims' perfect home kitchen, upgrade to new sleek designs inspired by European kitchen designs. Okay. Tap into your best interior design skill with a full set of counters and cabinets and matching appliances. The 
oven and stove, fridge and dishwasher. From amateur chefs who are looking to make their mark in the kitchen to food entrepreneurs who are ready to turn cooking into cash, any sim can live out their cooking dreams. Get ready for the stuff pack that will earn your sim a whole lot of dough. New small appliances, big kitchen upgrade. Small appliances can deliver big results in the kitchen with a brand new stand mixer. Side note, sims can eat edible cookie dough straight from the prepped ingredients jar. <laughs> Love that, the realism. Waffle maker and countertop pizza oven. Your sims can invite family and friends over for a three course heart shaped waffle brunch, lunch, or a night of homemade pizzas. I love that. Speaking of pizza, show off your sims' sleek modern pizza oven with new recipes inspired by traditional Italian flavors. <laughs> Chef's kiss. Your sims will become pizza pros, chopping toppings and tossing dough before sliding an unfinished pizza into the oven. Not a fanaza? Fanaza? Da? Not to worry, you'll have new focaccia bread. Recipes to experiment with too. Is there bruschetta? If not, I don't want it. We've added so many recipes over the years and it's a little trickier to find what you want. To support you in your Sims culinary quests, we've added filters. You can find the meal you're looking for in a fraction of the time in free base game update coming alongside this pack. Okay, so that's good to know that there is a free base game update. That's not the only thing that we've added in the base game update. Did anyone say free the cupcakes? Okay, yeah, we knew this. I saw this in the behind the Sims. Now you can cook cupcakes in the oven. Sell your creations to your neighbors. Fancy yourself an entrepreneur, Sims can become food stand owners, set up shops in different lots, bonding with customers and witnessing the outcomes of selling their creation. Players can customize the name of the food stand and choose the type of food they want to serve. Ooh, the waffle maker and pizza oven, street food style recipes and portable features make them the perfect companions for the stand. The ultimate cooking adventure wouldn't be complete without the right cooking attire. With kitchen ready hairstyles, matching food themed accessories and aprons for the whole family, we plan to have your Sims looking like serious home chefs. We love the new kitchen clogs. Oh my god, look at the clogs. Oh my gosh. Okay, interesting. Okay, so let's have a little look at the trailer again. So obviously, we've got this whole stand that is portable and can be taken to different places to sell. She's obviously wearing a new little chef outfit. I love this little lemon headdress, head wrap, head bandana -y sort of thing. She has got pizza earrings. I actually need those IR and a new necklace too. He's not a fan of that. All right, so this is the old style of kitchen. We are getting rid of that and putting all new stuff in. I love the look of these counters, like a marble top, kind of like granite top. You've got a new chef's block, which has been needed for so long. A little corner shelf unit here with like pots and pans. You've got casserole dishes, <gasps> little mini ones. That's cute. Look at all of this. That we've already got, so that's fine. But new colors or different color swatches for the knife blocks. A new recipe book, a new oven and hob combo. I'm hoping that comes together and that actually works. Namely because the dream home decorator one doesn't work if it's together. It has to be on two different counters. Blink and you'll miss any of it. I just saw a little herbs and spices thing. Bah. Oh, it's gone. It's on the corner counter. You can see it in the left corner. Cool though. Oh my God, look at that. Weighing scales with like a bowl on top. Love that. We've got this little shelving thing. Again, as I said at the beginning of this episode, <gasps> this. Look at this sink. We have needed a cool sink, like a European sink for so long. I will actually use that sink. I'm not gonna lie. Some of the sinks in the actual game are not that good, but this is amazing. That's my new favorite sink. That's a new extractor fan, I think, as well. Is that a new curtain? I want to say I hope so. Ooh, look at this. It's got a cheese grater. <gasps> Tomato soup. Love this. Oh, I love that swatch. Pastely blue and pink vibes. Ooh, black, dark sort of vibes as well. It is like a granite top too, which I absolutely adore. I love that pop of yellow. Speaking of yellow, there you go. Ooh, we got some cream and some raspberries, some jam, some blueberries, I, don't, I think. Or blackberries, maybe? Waffle maker is out. We're making like raspberry waffles. We've got the chef aid. 
with all of these different bits. Maybe these are different ingredients that are gonna be chucked in there. And of course the pizza oven, a classic. Where would we be without pizza ovens? I want one. Oh, look at their little outfits. There's the clogs, of course. She's obviously all dirty. She's got flour all over her. The little kid, her daughter, has got her own little apron and outfit as well. Oh, it's so cool. Pop the flour in. It's so nice because what? Are we gonna actually, oh, look at this, paella or something in the background. Are we actually gonna be able to see the process a bit more and it's gonna be a bit more interactive? As long as cooking doesn't take like seven in-game sim hours, then I'm excited for this. Look, oh, it looks as though she's actually taken a spice out of the rack there and then make it like the dough. I literally, I worked at Domino's when I was 16 until I went to university at 18. And yeah, you do that. You, like it's, this is just so, oh. And then it goes in raw, comes out, oh, delightful. And then she can go and sell that. Look at it. Oh yeah, she's got the pizza oven there with her. So I'm guessing she can bake it there and then. Are people gonna be asking what they want? Like, are they gonna be having orders and stuff? Oh, she's not happy, the one in the background. She's like, eh, I don't like pineapple on pizza. I agree, babes. I wholeheartedly agree with you. Let me know in the comments. Are you a pineapple on pizza fan or a hater? Because if you're a hater, I love you. In fact, like this video if you hate pineapple on pizza. Subscribe if you love pineapple on pizza. Oh, oh my God, I love his bandana. Sorry, I was too focused on pineapple on pizza that I didn't notice his cool bandana and his new top as well. Oh my goodness, I love the cupcakes as well. Lobbing the knives. Oof. I'm excited for the waffles. If, if, uh, there better be Nutella. I'm making a lot of threats tonight, but there better be Nutella. That looks like a good waffle, heart-shaped, perfect for Valentine's Day. There's chicken and waffles as well, which I have never thought to have. Is that an American thing? I'm gonna assume it is. Because you lot have scones with chicken and gravy, or gravy and scones. And to me, that is wild, because here, on our scones, we have cream and jam, potted cream. Look at these outfits. This whole family is matching, and I love that for them. They are all wearing the same outfit, but different. That's so cool. I love her jumpsuit um, that the lady, the mum, obviously is wearing. I'm so excited. Oh, look, now the stand is a waffle flavored. Look how cute it is. Oh, look at that zip. <gasps> it's a waffle zip. Wait, is it a waffle or a strawberry? I think it might be a strawberry. I have no idea. Look at her little headband, gorgeous. Oh, we've changed outfit now. We're in a professional little chef outfit. That's a cool little get up. What's on that pizza? It looks like there's pineapple on one slice. I'm not getting this stuff pack now. I refuse. Lots of herbs and spices going in here. Is that a new hairstyle for kiddos, by the way? Sorry, I'm so zoned in on all of the different things. Look at her apron as well. I think that's a new hairstyle and the lady's new hairstyle too. The main character with the little bandana as well. Ooh, what have we got? We've got the waffles. We've got different bits and bobs, like picky bits. That looks like a good pizza, me delicious. That, is that like a ranch pizza? I don't know. I had a ranch pizza in Canada and it was really nice. <gasps> Love this. Look at the pizza earrings. Can I please get some? I know Sims are doing merch soon, but are we gonna get any pizza earrings? Okay, she's got a new outfit. Oh, they're all wearing new outfits. Definitely wouldn't wear the one on the left. <laughs> It's a bit tacky, but everything else is really cute. Is his hairstyle new? Honestly, I don't really care because I don't use the clay hair. I'm a poet, didn't even know it. But some of the little outfits are cool. Like her little kind of zip up combo with the long sleeved t-shirt. Well, it's not a t-shirt, jumper, whatever you want to call it. Top. And then he's got a little waffle love heart. Very nice. The detailing on the cast items that The Sims are introducing in like the last couple of years have been phenomenal. <gasps> it's got a little runner, a table runner. Oh, my heart is happy. What is that pizza? And why is it blue? What on earth's that? That looks disgusting. Is that seafood or something? Maybe that's like a pizza that brings you back to life. Hold on, look at his little hat. Sorry, I'm noticing new things every time. Look at his little hat on the left. Pepperoni hat. Okay, wait, this decking's really cool. We've got that in game, I'm assuming, but. Oh, hey, I'm looking forward to this. I think now that I've like digested it or properly gone into it and looked at all of the different things and the different scenes, I'm looking forward to the pack. It'll be interesting to see. Interesting to see how much money we can make from this. If we can make it into a proper little business, how well we do, how much it brings into the family and actually get into the nitty gritty and get into the gameplay with the pack. And yeah, these are the different screenshots that we've got. That's a lovely little apron and top number that she's wearing. He's got a very dirty apron on with a little tea towel there as well. <gasps> this is really cool. That looks like a new hairstyle. She's got something behind her ear. Oh God. This is a whole look and a half. She's wearing a pizza. 
I love how the whole family are matchy matchy. Look at that little toddler or infant wearing a hat as well. I'm excited for it. You know, it is a stuff pack at the end of the day. So it's the smallest pack. So it's not going to be as much as you would expect in an expansion pack in this pack. But it looks like there is a fair amount of gameplay, you know, with the whole selling, the making money, adding to the cooking, adding more recipes into the game as well. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. I'm assuming there is going to be some sort of cross compatibility with Dine Out, but they are going to have to fix Dine Out for that to even work work so fingers crossed that all get sorted as well a little bit disappointed that there aren't certain like european slash british appliances in it such as maybe like a toaster or a kettle i was kind of looking forward to something like that to make cups of tea or toast you could even put waffles in a toaster as well so definitely think that that could have been included maybe even like a food processor or a blender as well but regardless i am looking forward to this pack we've got two weeks to wait i'm excited to see if my my sims can get their hustle and bustle and make a side hustle out of pizza making. I love pizza. My favorite is chicken, bacon, and sweet corn with a barbecue base and cheese as well. Let me know what your favorite pizza is down in the comment section below. And if you say pineapple, and if you get likes and people like other people with pineapple on their pizza, you're all getting banned. I'm joking, I'm just kidding. But pineapple does not belong on pizza. But let me know your favorite pizza down in the comment section below. Give this video a big thumbs up if you're excited for the pack don't forget to subscribe as well and i'll see you all in my next video or when the stuff pack comes out take care look after yourselves taz out